Blue Tick, serious fan. Now back again, one more time. Myself, Bugsy B. Myself, D Godan. And this week we got a friend of the show, good friend of the show. It's not his first rodeo. <laughs> He's back around again. Big Vic Santoro. Oh, he's saying, so pretty good Glory job. days on everything. What's going on? Yeah, hey, man. What are you telling me? Nothing, man. We're here, bro. What's going on? What's been happening since we last caught up? What was that? What year was that? That was two years 2000. ago. 2000. That was three lockdown. Three years ago. That was lockdown. Rage. That's, that was that's, lockdown. How, that's how mad it is. When we first started. Three years ago. You, you were one of our first guests. That was when we first started lockdown. Two years ago. Ooh. Free. Free. Yeah, 2020. Yeah, a lot has happened since then, isn't it? Yeah, it's, it's 20. No, but we started in October. So. I know, but. So, yeah, yeah. 2020. I can't lie though, your setup was proper though. Yeah, big ass. I can't lie. Respect. Like, big ass. Yeah, the, 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 the setup was proper. I can't even lie. It's professional. Make the people them know stuff. <laughs> <laughs> All right, first and foremost, shouts out to Blue Rum. Don't know the thing already. Hey, no, the new flavor. You see the purple team? Links in the bio. See the purple team? It's mad. It's mad still. It's mad. Best one for me so far. Best one yet. Best one yet. You lot should buy some for your parties and your events and all that. Yeah, no, that's good stuff. Big, trust big me. Big him up, man. You get me? Quailers. Quailers always come true. Safi six. God, check Never lets us down. Who else? And I hate that. We're not big up no one else. Nobody. If, if you're not up here, you're not get you're not get no big up. So yeah, Vic man, big up man. Thanks for coming to you again. No, come on man, you know the vibes. Part two, mm. you get me. So what's been happening on the music front? What's going on? Because since glory days, we ain't into it again. Yeah, yeah, and you see your glory it. days project, I must make it known. That was a bad boy project. Yeah, no, come so on, man. big up yourself it. for that. You see the rollout. Get me. You see the promotion run that Yeah, I appreciate it. The rollout on that promotion, yeah, it was proper things still. Yeah, well, no, I appreciate it. Was proper that, things, proper, proper things. Your you performance. Um, the show was banging. Yeah, Where the was show, the show again? Oh, to um, Islington. Islington. Yeah, that was yeah, a bad boy show as well. Yeah, that was nice though. So that so that was that was nice. And you know what? Everyone was in there. It was. I think probably my best show. It was I a good vibe, man. You, you vibe. done well, man. You was you was comfortable with that one. You yeah, get me? Yeah, nah, definitely, man. That was that was good. You had, you had my cousin on it. Yeah, nah, definitely. I think you see with me, like I think with them things there, it's like even when I was talking to the venue and I was like, I need, I'm gonna do ten opening acts, and they're like, yeah, no one, no one does that. I'm saying, yeah, but my thing don't work if the everyone ain't involved. Yeah, yeah, you get what I'm saying. Like, I do my, see that. You get what I'm saying. My thing don't work in, unless, say unless, unless everyone's involved. I do see that's that. That's what I said about you. you bus people. A man has to give you your man yeah, yeah, everyone has to be involved. So he was like, he, they were mad nervous, like, and especially like the man that was in there burning all types of things, and they coming downstairs and be like, yo, listen, I'm saying, yo, the village is in it. That's cut, like, just cool, like everything. Right, the man, just let the man them do what they're doing. It's fine, like, you get me, and like, thank God, like, it went went smooth and left no incidents. I thought. For that venue there, that's they don't really see that with rappers. So nah. from I did that, it means certain other man could go and do you're that command to prove open that the door. Yo, we can we can conduct the thing professionally, why not? No hundred. I ain't gonna lie, it's players. one of the roughest O2s I've been to. <laughs> do you know what I mean, innit? That is like Yeah, no, nah, that is the, yeah, that is the spot. Like, yeah, no, nah, definitely. Big up O2 is there for that. No, it's the, out of all the O2s, that is the one that they will have nah, man. certain Brixton. There's there's no rougher than Brixton. Yeah, but the capacity in Brixton is bigger. So yeah, yeah, I know, but... It's you all, get what I'm trying yeah, to say. Yeah. I, but for a small venue, it's very... Mm. You get me, but big them up though, man, definitely. No, 100%. Yeah. March, your question, because I see Indie pushing you, you get me? Your, your record indie. label, yeah, Big Indie, they, yeah. They, they, I could see that they were... They, they believe in you. Do you get me? Yeah, no, nah, big them up, man. They, them lot are like family, man, because... Them man... Like, I, like, I signed like a joint venture with them, but they signed with me without even hearing no music. Oh, well done. Just on, like, real talk, on God, like, just going on, going to a lunch and saying, yo, this is my vision, this is what I believe can work. And they were just like, yeah, let's do it. They didn't even hear no music. Oh, that's tough. Big. You get me? And little things like when I've got, you know, my cases with immigration, they've always been to come to court. So they're like family, oh, like, so well beyond business. So what they did was, because leading up to that, I had been sort of networking, building the resources for myself. Because when you go and you got to do DIY, you got to play every role. So you're doing 10 people's jobs. 100. So by the time I got to a point where I was having a conversation with them, I didn't really need them for certain things. Please. I just need them to push the product. So then it made sense. We're going to joint venture. So 50 you 50. push, I work. Yeah, mm -hmm. so like I'll, I'll put the whole thing together and we'll use the machine you lot got and to see push. you to push yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, so yeah, yeah, yeah. Are you that still sign sense. Sense. Nah, nah. So we did two projects. Um, so Glory Days got done and Voice of the Village was the second project. So that was, so once that finished. How I many balls hard on Voice of the Village though? You know what, the promotion, you know, I, you know, you want to hear the realest? It's like, the promotion wasn't, 
I don't think the promotion was how I wanted it to be, but, but those are just budget issues, isn't it? Like oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. things you can't avoid. Because remember, like you lock in releases months in advance. So if we get to the release date and even if certain like funds are not available, you gotta still find a way to put the product out because you've got a base in it. So it's like you gotta so mm. if I could do it different with a bigger, you know what I'm saying, budget, I would have done the village different. However, on the live shows, it's the songs that have been performed mainly is the voice of the village songs. Yeah, I think you should chat about that, the importance of promotion. Yeah, now it's brother, it's it's one of the most making making the music is the easiest part. 100%. Like getting the beat and rapping on it. That's the easiest part. And then it's like putting it out and trying to market it. Because remember, like, everything is about algorithms. And not only that, people are busy. The world has changed. So it's like no one's, your thing ain't just popping up on, on someone's thing. Mm -hmm. You get what I'm trying to say? So you can't be arrogant to think, no, this thing's cold. So man's supposed to check for it. So in the early, like, for like an artist that just comes into it, you might all be holding feelings that man ain't support your thing, but man ain't seen it, fam. 100%. And you know what? Mm. You're, real about, you're real about that because mm. the more that there's growing, the more the internet's growing, is the more content. It's the more, you know what I'm saying? So people's got different things to do. So you've got to find different ways of putting so much, something, putting it back, like, on the table for, for man to, like, to look at continuously. You can't just think, well, I'll come, you know what I'm saying to you? So you've got to mm. keep pushing. Because, for example, Coca Cola. They advertise their drink every day. Like you no, see the adverts. Yeah, no, so no. if you're pushing something like a product, something I learned late, because I used to think, nah, I shouldn't have to be like every day be on it. But it's just like, well, who do you think you are? Like, of course you have oh, to be. Every, of course you do it every day. You do, do, do it every day. You, you, you do are you? Like, you have, so, sorry, but my throat is killing me. But I learned yeah. that late. You know, what I'm saying to you. But yeah, that's one of the things I learned. But a market is very important because that's the only way. Because it's okay fe feeling like you're ready or you're good enough. That's one separate thing. Mm. But you gotta put yourself in front of the people and they've gotta accept you. Without the people accepting you, you can't do nothing. That's the bottom line. Let me ask you a question. What would you say the best form of promotion? I still think it's word of mouth. I think no. word of mouth is never gonna no. die when it comes to certain things. Internet. You can't you can't beat the internet. Mm -hmm. You can't you can't beat the internet now. Word of mouth's good, but word of mouth can only take you so far. Yeah, but a repost is like a word of mouth, no? Does that make sense? It's, it's, it's something that you've taken in that you now want to share with other people, whether you said it or not. Mm. The fact that people won't repost your stuff, you get 10 people reposting something, it's a, it's a monkey see, monkey do world. Mm. Do you it? know what's funny? Do you know what's funny? That 10 people reposting your team. Do you know how much interaction that adds to your post? 100. It's mad. People don't, people don't, people look at it like, I'm saying like five man repost the team. Offer of your account alone, offer of them five accounts. How many people are gonna interact with that post? Mm -hmm. And a yeah. man will a man won't look at it right. And what I'm saying to man, repost man's thing. Man are moving like I'm nuts for getting upset because man's not reposting. I'm saying it's free to repost. That to me is the internet word of mouth. I'm not gonna front. I don't understand. Yeah, no, mm. word of mouth is important still. Mm -hmm. Obviously, it's, it has to be created through, no, because, through some type of medium, innit? You mm -hmm. see, you see why the internet's mad because it's like it's like it's like now. You see the internet. Word of mouth only goes so far. The internet's global. Mm. A man in India who's never fucking heard of you before could stumble across your shit and like it. Mm. Mm. I hear that. You get what I'm saying? So you can't, you can't beat the internet for promotion still. Yep, so what I'm going though? We have to get, we have to get nitty gritty. <laughs> Yeah, we're trying to ease you in, we're trying to... See, 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 like, to I, I see, I see, I see the taxes. The team, I, I wanna talk, first and foremost, I want to talk about what you, you, you got a glory days too, yeah? Um, so yeah, so basically, days. or a record label, should yeah. I say. So yeah, I've just launched a label. So I came out of the situation with um, Big Indy, so that deal was completed. So I, then we got an imprint off the back of it. So it's like Glory Days Records is what I'm running with. So I set up the label. We're still in business, like in different, like department wise, but now I own the label and I'm sort of running it. Any artists you want to tell the people about that you've signed? Fam, you know what? There's a lot of man on the ends that have been like, especially the young boys. There's a lot of like. I've been yeah, really yeah, active, yeah, oh, actively promotion. looking. Oh this yeah, no, exactly but, no, 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 like, they got like, I think like, it's too easy to like, create a piggy bank situation. Everyone around me works for this, you get what I'm trying to say to you? Wow. Like, and I think that's a precedence. It's easy to just say, say for example, a man like me, I never like, when I came home, it wasn't about, I understood, at first, it was like, now nah, man's supposed to shout me out and pick me up and da 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 and say, yo, my man can rap, you get what I'm trying to say to you? But that was just based on my own ego feeling like, I know I'm cold for a man supposed to promote that. But guess what? I started looking at things, but you can think you're cold all you want, but you, where's your catalog, fam? 100%. You ain't got no catalog. So you, this is just something in your head. So well, you have to show the people you got a catalog, even for the people around you, you get what I'm saying? There's a lot of people, even family members, who I probably still don't take the music thing as serious. Like my mum had to come to the show. 
because mm. prior to that it's just yeah, like yeah, what yeah, you dealing yeah, with yeah, like what's yeah, this yeah, music yeah, I get it you get what I'm saying mm-hmm. so I feel like all the people around me because it's only my you know my fact like my cousin my little brother and things like that it's like everyone does music in their capacity but I believe in like everybody like really standing on wanting to do it it's too easy to say yo like big someone up and rare one or this and and anytime you come to my shows or anything they're performing anyway yeah yeah you get yeah, what I'm saying yeah, to you yeah, so yeah. definitely so but shout out everyone on the label though but nobody's at the moment I'm just kind of looking at outside of my circle because everything I do is normally Within. my brother my cousin everything's yeah, family yeah, related yeah, but yeah. now I'm like okay cool, <laughs> let me look outside of that so there's a lot of like interesting like talent like that I'm seeing I'm like okay cool we're gonna try and figure something out soon big CEO no, Vic <laughs> nah not big not big I'm trying to think I'm trying to think that's why you're coming here looking nah, at nah, 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 nah. I'm trying to think I'm just trying to think <laughs> what else you got going on other than the label um, I got um, so we're do, I'm doing a business showcase in Piccadilly Circus next month for so. the black for the black business like little business it's, yeah, black business is definitely is my focus but it's you know mainly about because a lot of the times when we do these trade shows like a lot of the bigger businesses sign up, take the pictures and you know, the other businesses don't get seen. So my thing is I want to bring, it's cool like the village showcase. And I was able to like get the venue in Piccadilly Circus right underneath the, where the screens are. Yeah. Okay. Right yeah, yeah. there, that's a look, you know, the footfall is about half a million a day and it's a bank holiday weekend as well. So my thing is bring businesses, it doesn't matter if in if it's Blue Rum, whoever, it's like, come set, blue tick, come set up blue a tick, tick, come set up a pitch, the footfall's crazy. And it allows you route to international, you know, clients and things like that. 100%. So I want to try and, and also I want to show that we can, again, come to those type of spaces and represent because we don't have, you don't have to park me off in a venue, you know, it's somewhere in South London or somewhere in Harsden or something like. I can be where the central yeah, yeah, bit is yeah, and yeah, we can still conduct business there. So that's that. that's next month. So anyone that wants to sign up to it, I think there's some more there's some more spaces left. So any businesses that want to sign up to it. Just, yeah, go on the gram, you know, hit up the team, and yeah, they'll definitely hook you up. There you go. That's sick. Anyone who's doing the business team. That's sick. So what mm. else you want to ask me? Um. Huh? I don't know, still. <laughs> Loudest, man. I don't know, still. <laughs> nah, I'm just thinking that, like, obviously, on your pro- just on your progress moving forward, I just Don't wanted to know what you had ahead. Yeah, no, nah, that's, that's, that's happening. What's that? What's that? Got a couple projects in the pipeline. Um, I think... Because of my immigration situation, it messes up a lot of like contractual. Is situation. that not done now? No, nah, that's not even done yet. You know, fucking hell. Still fighting. Yeah, right? Still fighting immigration. Still, that's not done. It's done in the sense of like, there's not much they can do. There's not much they can do, but they, they're still making. dragging their heels and sort of like dotting the eyes and crossing the T's and just so so we can put it to bed. So basically, yeah, so that's the ongoing. Okay, waiting for cool. you to mess up. Yeah, naturally. Yeah. That's, that's what they do. Yeah, they, they can keep waiting, man. All right, boom. Nothing, nothing, nothing else like anybody else wants to talk about? Mm, no. You sound, hey. you sound like you got some heavy topics. Who's me? <laughs> no, we no, just got... Wanna, look, you see remember, we put the question. Wait, you, know, you see today, you saw what I put up. On the, on the ground. Oh, the people that send the question. The people, people them want no. The people them want no, you get me? It's not me. I'm going to say that's what the people them want no. Yeah, yeah. yeah. me? No, nah, naturally. Naturally. Like, Blood, I'm just going to get into it because everybody's like, pussy for him. Naturally. Blood, rated awards. What went down from your perspective? Don't mention no names, like, but what went down from your perspective? Because the reason why we asked this because you see when it comes to the rated awards, yeah. your name was connected. It was like really? a paper clip, fully connected <laughs> to the team. Fully involved. Do you understand? There was never, there was never any talk without your name being mentioned. Mm. You get what I'm saying? And yeah. certain other men, I'm, I'm not going to say their name. They've gone on the other, net, they've gone on the net and pushed the narrative. Mm-hmm. You get me? So man's the same from the horse's mouth. What is it? So this is what I'm trying to say, like I was going to, like touching on what you just said about the narrative, yeah? I think like, you see the times we're living in and because everything's so like in your face and everything's so public, like people don't know the disparity of what's actually something that should be on the internet and, and something that shouldn't, that shouldn't be. You get what I'm saying yeah, to you? Yeah, so yeah. I agree with Respectfully, that. I'm sure people are speculating or whatever not, but whatever happened at the rate of the walls is not something that's for the internet. And I'm not about to be the voice or the or the standpoint for it that goes to break that down. It's for the people that were there, it was their business. For the people that wasn't there, it's none of their business. <laughs> Yo, bitch. So, 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 so giving the people the main So they're gonna have to something not everything's on the internet. Listen, you see my thing is about integrity, innit? Mm-hmm. It's about integrity. So if a situation involves me, 
then mm-hmm. I've got the leeway to want to speak on it or not. But I'm not going to speak on nobody else's situation. Because right, right, yeah. yeah. that's, 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 that's not my standpoint. So, yeah. Because that, that was, that, you see that? That's media training. <laughs> Bad boy I don't media go, I, don't, I don't deal with all that. Yeah. All right, then. Yeah. Let's yeah. address what's on the internet already. Go on, tell me. What's the answer? You get me? Um, are you and Spray still friends? No. Spray, so what, what's, what's going on with you two? You see again. This is like, this. This is. And that's people out on the internet. This no, is like, this goes. This, this, this goes back to what I'm saying. It's a thing where I think you would have. To, has he ever spoken about one of friends? Yeah. What did he say? Yeah. <laughs> what did he say? Tell me. Because I'm not like I'm not privileged to these things. Um, has he ever spoken? Yeah. So what did he say? What did he say? And when you quote him, make sure you're quoting something you actually. Yeah, not not yeah, your yeah, words. Yeah, 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 yeah. Something you saw. Stop, stop, stop. Yeah. Go ahead. Yeah. Listen, listen. Go ahead. It was something along the lines of. Not along the lines, I don't know exactly what you said. No, I can't, re- I can't remember it. I'm not even saying it then, because I can't remember it word for word. So I don't want to say if I say it and then I put my foot in it. I don't, I'm not really on that. You get what I'm saying? So I don't want to address that. Is there no way of you <coughs> rectifying your yeah, friendship? Yeah, you lot were close, friend. You lot were close. And the internet saw this. So the internet's always going to ask the question. You said one thing. See what's out on the internet. Yeah, it allows people to see and ask the question. <laughs> now, people don't know what happens Imagine. behind closed doors. They just see the fact that you two don't... You understand and, me? It's not public remember, no more. Remember, you know, remember the story. You remember what the story is? Go on. He came there with you. <laughs> when he got rushed, you weren't with him. That's what's out on the internet. Do you, so, get, do you get what I'm saying? That's that's the that's what's out there. Sorry, let me get so sorry. Say that again. He, he what? He came there with you, and then when he got rushed, he wasn't with you. That's that's the, this is, this is the story. Okay, without going into it, that's completely fabrications. There you go. W- without going into it and trying to, because again, I'm not going to do that complete fabrication. This is why, look, here's the thing about it, yeah. It's like, I'm okay with people having the wrong perspective of a situation they know nothing about. Yeah, Does that make sense? Yeah, I'm not trying to clear up my rumors. Like, I'm okay with you thinking what you're thinking based on the fact that you don't actually know. I know you don't know. So it's like, Facts. and it's not for me to clarify it for you because respectfully, it's none of your business. You I feel what that. I'm saying to you? That's why a lot of the times I let a lot of these stories run online or people say stuff when I hear stuff. I'm not even focused. For me, I'm, I'm in such in a different place. It doesn't even matter. But you know the one thing what I'm going to say? Don't, don't you miss the man's friendship? Because <laughs> you lot were close, bro. <laughs> wife, wife. wife for that. <laughs> what friendship? <laughs> Loud of that, man. <laughs> My bro, let me tell you something. No, you know what I'm going to no, say? No, let me say, no, I'm going to answer what he said. Fam, I spent, I went to jail when I was 17. I came out when I was 28, bro. Missing friendship. 100. I get All right, cool. Let's not. I don't know. It says I'm no built more. different. Yeah, you know, yeah, you know, yeah. That's yeah. not even a question. You see what question. the problem is now? You see what the problem is with all of us? Me, you, him, all of Spray. Every, blue rum. Every, no, not blue rum. All, right. all of us, yeah? We have made ourselves public property. This is the problem. We live our life in the camera. We've made ourselves public property. It's a TV so when people want to know, show. when people when people want to know, no, but doesn't, you put yourself out there. Yeah, it's a TV you know, show. It's a TV people show. People are going to want to know. This it's is a what TV I'm show. You put yourself in the public for people to know you. So people are going to question it, innit? Yeah, no, and you put your friendship you in the public. <laughs> you, see a man yeah. who lives, you see a man who lives private. Yeah. No one can't ask him that. Yeah, but that, that's what I'm saying. I, I have no issues with questions. We are, I have no issues with questions. We are internet personalities. Whether we're Z, B, D, A, whatever. We're internet personalities. Yeah. So things that go on on the internet, we for speak pun. Mm-hmm. But this is what I'm saying to you, but you're asking about things behind closed doors. No. <laughs> can your friendship be repaired? <laughs> Anything can be repaired in the sort. Like anything can be repaired. It's all about perspective. Time is a good healer. Like it's all about everything's about perspective. You get what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. So have, have mm-hmm. you and him spoke? No. Never, never again. Wow. That's wild. So That's obviously, wild. no, I'm not even getting into it because obviously I can't, <laughs> I can't even be bothered, mate. <laughs> let's let's move on to something else. What what do you would you like to know? <laughs> Fuck you now. This is mad. I tried to I tried to get out of him. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I tried yeah, to get. Yeah. I tried to get to the nitty gritty, and he's not going for it. So, what do you say? Because uh, you got to remember, there's, there's there's your truth and there's everybody else's, isn't it? You know, like say for example, like if this we was looking at this in terms of like a seasonal thing, bro. Like this is like I'm on my like six season, fam. So it's like I understand where I'm at, what it is, and how I need to carry myself within that space. You get? What I'm trying to say to you, mm-hmm. I'm not. This is not something. 
my brand is not something I'm just trying a thing with. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm a hundred percent committed to this. You get what I'm trying to okay. say to you. Mm-hmm. So with that comes integrity and responsibility, especially like in my early days, maybe I may go on interviews and just speak. Like rec- you know what I'm saying? Or mm-hmm. just to recklessly. On top of that, I hold a certain stature within the community. So definitely I got to lead by example. So, so basically mm-hmm. what you're saying is you've had media training now. <laughs> You've come up in levels. It's levels. I got my media training. I'm six seasons I know. In. I, I know how to deal with you. I journalists. know how to chat. You know how to talk to us journalists. <laughs> That's what you're saying, like, basically. <laughs> I'm saying everything's a choice, isn't it? So yeah, man. Yeah. So boom. You you see what the hey, the spades thing? Because we were just watching it before you yeah. come. Yeah. So what 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 really went on? Is that is that an internet thing? Can I ask no, 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 no. You were no, foaming out your mouth on one of these things. Can I ask you about that? Can I, I, ask talking, about? No, no, I can speak on that. So I understand where the confusion was with that, right? So in the interim of it, remember, like, I'm party to it because my name was mentioned, i.e. he called my name out. Oh, yeah. so he called you out, yeah? Rest in peace to Hypo, you get what I'm trying to say mm-hmm. to you? Big but, you know, yeah, big him up always. Definitely. Um, so they called my name out. They was going through a list of rappers. Oh, yes, who I remember be that, actually. And my name come out. And you got to remember, like... Oh, yeah, it was Hypo in yeah, space. Yes, yes, yeah, yes. Yeah, it was Hypo You know what I'm saying? So you got to remember, them days there, I'm, like, in the lab trying to work my angle out. So in those types of... And this is my fresh day. So the moment you call my name, I already know what it is because it's already trending you that you lot are calling names so i understand how the system works it's like oh you might okay cool okay yeah boom yeah I, i'll take that mm-hmm. but it first started as like sort of like conversation then a friend of mine like a good friend of ours like he then came in on the, as a on a private investor thing like i'll show with he the put the yeah, money yeah, on remember, the table i remember that i remember like that. i know so both of you rare, 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 and yeah, it wasn't gonna be like some arena thing it was a, a the ring built somewhere in a park it's a mafioso thing you know the vibes you get mm. what i'm trying to say to you so he came in on that angle and he, all he wanted me to do is sell the fight he says can you sell the fight and i was like i can sell the fight so the fight was sold but obviously he couldn't go ahead yeah but beyond that it was never i'm never i've never like my stance has never been oh i'm the best fighter ever i want to fight people that was just like a business opportunity and the numbers were like this Fab. winner takes 70 Fab. loser takes 30. Fab, you was talking Mad, no, mad. I, we just watched you it. You wanted to fight him. You were talking about fighting him without the bread. You were talking about, talking about I'm not giving you four weeks. Pull up now to my road. Let's yeah, go to the know, park. I'll knock you out. That's just, that's the, you know what I'm saying? The, the, the front of the lobe is not activated then. It's not, it's not, it's not working properly then. Like, come on, you know where we're from? Like, the man them, listen, I always say the man them's all a sandwich short of a picnic. Man can be as cool as man is, but you know what I'm saying? There are modes that man can tap into. So for me, it was just about selling the fight, but naturally, even within that space, I'm not understanding that I'm a brand and I'm pushing it. So when you say certain things to me, my reaction is based on like a man said it to me on the corner of the road. Mm-hmm. So those are lessons I have to learn the hard way. Like you're not talking to a man on the side of the road. So you see your reactions when you're across from a camera. It can't be, like it can't that. be, it can't be the same. But these are all learning curves, anyway. So why didn't that fight go ahead again? He couldn't like. I've said this already, like, and I hate saying it, because every time I'm saying it, it's like, I'm trying to take something from him. Like, give sh- some buttons. Shout out to Jay Spades, by the way, Are first and foremost. No, we're not brethren, but shout, you know, shout him out, definitely. Mm. I definitely wish that brother well. The doctors wasn't willing to sign for him to take to go in the fight. And you know that. You see the, doc- the same doctor. Huh. They could, yeah, they wasn't willing to put their, their medical license oh, okay, on it. Okay, okay, okay. Put it that, that way. Are you saying he's not healthy? <laughs> nah, you're funny. I'm asking. Nah, I'm asking. I'm asking. I'm asking. I'm not saying he ain't. I'm asking. What is he not healthy? You'd have to ask him. Maybe you should get him to come and do an episode. You'd have to ask him why the doctors didn't want to like. They didn't like. They didn't obviously. Hey, space, come true, man. Yeah, let's, talk so about, let's talk about the boxing. Come nah, true. Shout out space, come true. All right, boom. You know what? I think we've already spoke about this, but this is another question. What somebody asked. Go on. The truth behind you and African child. I said the truth you and behind AC. you. That's what they asked. I'm just saying what the people have asked. It's not, this ain't my question. So what's the truth? Like, in the truth in the sense of what? Like, I don't... I, 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 I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm guessing that they're, they're talking in regards to what what they never saw on camera, innit? Which that, was... Which, I don't know. How, it start, <laughs> how did that even start? Did he call you out once again? Nah, like, look. He's explained it. If you look at, he's done a recent interview in Biggie, or like on Biggie. Yeah, if you yeah, go and yeah. check it, he's asked the question and he articulates it, the answer. So anyone that wants to see that, shout out Big Ego Media, go on there and see that. He answers it already. Yeah, check and, it out. And for me, like, for me to, the way, the, the sincerity he came with, for me to speak about, go into the situation again, I think 
it's kind of like blood, me dragging them in. You know, blood. No, you don't have to answer something. Bro, it's all on the internet. It's, it's all, all on the internet. It's all on the internet. It's all on the internet. From your perspective. It's all on the internet. From your perspective. It's all on the internet. Let's go Let's go from your perspective. It's not going to work. Look, it's a simple thing like this here, bro. It's like, he was a friend, did something he shouldn't have done, and he's now apologised for it. And in between the apology and and him doing what he's doing, there was a reaction to it. It's all on the internet. It's all okay. Let me ask you something. Like, do you feel bad for what you've done to him? Because he was going through mental illness. <laughs> <laughs> so I just want to ask. And he took his 10 you bags out of his bag, and his Bible, bag. and his Bible. And you was with him. Yeah. yeah. I know he was there. I know you was there. You got, you got yeah. Hey, a man said you took my, a man said you took my 10 quid and the Bible. Give me back my things. <laughs> yeah, you might say, look, that's obviously that never happened. Like, I know. <laughs> But obviously not again, but this is the times when you got to think of it, yeah? This is what I'm talking about. This is where I'm getting mad. Because this is all on camera. Uh, you don't want to say this, you know? I'm getting mad. It's all of that stuff. <laughs> <laughs> you don't want to do that on the air. <laughs> yeah? <laughs> yeah, yeah, Zan. <laughs> yeah. So, like, you, you got to check it, yeah? Mm. It's like, what was I even doing? Do you get it? Mm. 100. You know what I'm saying? Okay. What was I doing? Do you feel I, like you could have put your brand at stake by doing that? No, no, listen, I did put my brand at stake. Do you know when I realised what was I doing? When I got there and saw his reaction, that's when I realised, oh, this was just all the internet. Like, then I saw, I realised, oh, bro, what am I even doing? Like, I was proper like, oh, snap, oh, bro, this is not real life. But you're still moving bad, though. You, you, you didn't slap out of it that much. Yeah, but you, you know, see, like, man, man's in the zone, man, man's see, in the zone, got, innit? You see, he got there and he realised, but fuck, nah, I don't care. No, man's in the zone, innit? So it was just one of those moments. It's, it's a moment of madness, bro. Yeah, that's no, like, yeah, that's, that's what, cool. those little things let me know the internet is different. For real life. life. For real life. And, 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 and I'll measure it different. Mm. See, I answered it. You get what I'm saying? You did well. I rate that. I'm proud of you, still. I'm proud of you. You know what? What, what was the other question now? All right, cool. Let's get in the questions. Let's get in the questions. Let's just put this out there. Okay, let's just on. get this one out of the way, innit? Because everybody wants to know. Everybody keeps talking about it. Talk you you and Sparks. Yeah, go on, talk to right? me. Right? It's an age-old story. Age-old story. Tell the people them how that goes. I've heard, I've heard, I've heard all the little fabrications. Exactly, so now, you need to clear that. You, this is... Yeah, this yeah, is no, definitely. You. Yeah, definitely. this is all you, you know? Definitely. Because there is no other side right now. I've got you. Right, cool. <laughs> I've got you. I've got you. I've got you. Yeah, first of all, rest in peace and God bless the dead always. R.I.P. the ghost the dead forever. Mm. My OG. Now, I'm going to talk about... My relationship with him, again, I don't know why there's even a conversation about it. If this was something that like, for example, like to make up, for example, or just make, if I was making this up, some of my friends would have been like, no, I never seen him come to Cernan to pick up a Vic or no, he never done no moves with him or I, that somebody around him would say that. Mm-hmm. Do you get what I'm saying to you? So, 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 so break it down, break it down. Let me learn. Go on. Let me learn. Listen. This lead, leads back to the same thing people always say. They go, Vic used to get sent out by Sparks. And when, every time I heard that, I've laughed. It's always been funny to me over the years. You only get sent out when, you're, when you go and do something that you don't want to do. So now it brings you back to the original your question. Mm-hmm. How I link Sparks? Road. Man had a, no, man had a, when I was shot in Crow, man had a local spot up on Broccoli Road. The man didn't know what's up. One day that yard got burgled. Yeah? Again, these are real facts. Mm-hmm. The yard got burgled. Man been building this thing up like from then, so the yard get burgled and it's like, and then that man's in beef for the use of burgled it, but there's no peas. So okay. I'm thinking, this is long. Like, now nah, I got a beefer man and we've got to try and build the thing, but this is long. So my thing naturally, I'm on the block. Get out there. Shout out Fat P, shout out Rossi, shout out you, shout out Dean, shout out. So, the, so it's go roll season. So when the man them's coming on the block, they're not talking about trapping. The man them's talking about what's gone on. That's my influences, I'm from Turnham. So that's what we're not, it's not necessarily hustlers in the sense of man building phones and all of that. The man them step on stuff. You get what I'm trying to say mm-hmm. to you? So that's what I'm hearing. I'm saying, okay, cool, the works. At that time, that's when Sparks just came out of jail. So I'm hearing what I'm hearing as well. I went to a man, I don't even want to say his name, but shout out Jay, I'm going to just abbreviate it. I said to him, look, I said to him, yo, introduce me to your brethren. Cause you know man to unrear what not. And he's like, yo, but no, nah, I'm saying, listen, look, I've, like, I've got a car, I already drive. Da, 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 da. Like, yo, introduce my man. Rang my man, first time I ever met him, Erika Road, pulled up, shout out Spud, and it's just like, yo, boom, 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 boom. And the conversation went from there. Okay. And I'm saying, yo, this is what I'm on. I've heard you're the guy, blah, blah, blah. 
and it went on from there. Nah. All right then, cool. So that's exactly. So these are the facts. The people that were there will verify it. And and here's the thing about it: when people talk about, bro, my thing was licking it. That's like everyone had their own thing that they were into. That's what I'm into. Mm-hmm. You get what I'm trying to say to you. Mm-hmm. And I go on to say, even when I went to jail for the for the for the for the Rolex shop in Bournemouth, that mm-hmm. had nothing to do with Sparks. Oh man, said, oh, you went in jail for a move. That had nothing to do with it. Was that UNK? That was just, that was my that was my move. On top of that, I wasn't even supposed to be on it. Mm. But again, because I got myself into a position where I don't have to really be on it, I scope things on God. Mm. You get what I'm trying to say mm-hmm. to you? But I decided to go on that one because that's my forte. Mm-hmm. And that, you know what I'm saying? So really, the, the fabrication or the stories or the narrative, and naturally, you wouldn't know that because guess what? I've never been in the old days, bro. Like, remember this, man's a refugee, bro. So the name brand thing on the end or being the name brand you, it's never been my thing, fam. Mm. You get what I'm trying to say to you? I just want paper. So that's why you may have not seen me standing up in Yates with a man or a man may have not seen me here or there or this and that because I'm only on Ring Me to do that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I'm not on... and Because when you're from African household specifically, I think just from a black household, you have a separate life, you live at home and there's a separate life on road. So I was trying to be one of them youths that was walking the line of doing whatever I'm doing on the road but at home presenting a different version. Obviously it didn't last because obviously I ended up where I ended up. Mm-hmm. You get what I'm saying mm-hmm. to you? So my mindset of that was different. So I, I know why people may be like, I didn't see this, I didn't, you wouldn't have unless you was on the on the move. You wouldn't have seen it. 100%, I hear that. So that's... So at least man can clear that up, yeah? Like, so I mean, no, my thing is, you see the age group, the age difference. See a, a, a certain man sending out man. Like I get it. But enough man were getting sent out. Yeah, bro, so, so man can't, you man can't sit here and just be like, yo, how dare a man say I was sent out? You know what's ironic? Man was sending out big man. Let me just talk. Go on, bro. See, see, when it, see, see when it comes to this whole, I don't even like to mention Andy because it's just Andy, innit? I just don't like mentioning him, yeah? But you see when it comes to this whole Andy thing, yeah? Andy sent out a hundred, blood. <laughs> big I was about man, to get into that. Andy sent out, there's, there's, you know what? He's the only man that I will say there's no shame in saying you got sent out from it. Exactly. So see, this like, is, this is, see, mm. like, you see, like, in, I wouldn't say that about nobody else. It's a shame. You're not supposed to be, and it still is a shame if you get sent out by him, but, you know. So, no, 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 that's a deep it, because we've all got kids here. Bro, you see, the, when man's talking about, I'm 15, fam. Man's talking about when I was 15. This is not, so even if that was the case, so let's just, let me put it into people. You got sent out by Even, even if that was the case, the most, the person, the most serious person where I'm from, even, 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 if that were, even if that was the case, the most serious person where I'm from is telling me to go and put work in. And naturally, this is what, I'm not supposed to what, rise through the ranks. What, I, can't, I, what, I, have to, I have to start off as a boss. Is that, is that, is that what no. the thing is? What, you you can't what? Start, you, even if that was the case, you can't start off as a soldier and work your way up. Because I don't know nobody that built nothing from starting from a pinnacle position. Mm-hmm. But even though that wasn't the case, so when I hear these, these stuff, for me, it's just like, I just think it's just clearly, the reason I don't address this stuff is just like, how anyone would no, logic, the reason why anyone would logic would make reason, sense of it. The reason, why, the reason why I want you to address these things here, yeah is because I'm going to keep it 100% real with The man then, he's friends. Like, he, he's friends. He, he's boys. The man them that he was with day in, mm. day out. Mm. Them man are kind of disputing your story. Yeah, but so, the, it comes down to the same thing. Unless she was on the move, you don't know what happened. And I wouldn't be here saying that. I, there's no way in this world I could be sitting there saying it all my chest. Well, are you doing? I'm be saying this. And it's untrue. It's impossible. Because mm. somebody will say no, he's that's a lie. Somebody there'll be somebody that could so and that's not the case. So the people that are saying they don't know or may not know, or whatever not, it's just kinda like, okay, cool, that's okay. You may not know, and that's it. fine. There is man that as as you can hear, there's man that are saying these things are lies, but it's not publicly. So a lot of the stuff that's being said is not public. So it's like Behind closed doors, basically, you get me. No, so you know why man can publicly speak. See, yeah, about man can speak on it. You see, now let, but you know what it comes wait, wait. out to the same let thing. Let me say though. this. Let no, me say bro. this. Yeah, the reason why it's 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 going to be questioned. Yeah, it's because like, all right, then cool. So you know that me and Rambo, me and Rambo was rolling. We was in turn. Yeah. If if somebody let's say Daniel, Daniel wasn't in turn. Yeah? yeah, but he's saying he was. Mm. But then everybody else around us, me and me, me and Dean ain't even saying that. But everybody else around us is saying how, he wasn't in turn. How dare you make him? People say are gonna that. people are gonna question it. <laughs> yeah, okay, but you know what it is? I'm happy you use it as uncle. Ask Rambo. 
There you go. Hey, ring the alarm. He's your family member. Ask him. He's your family member. He's your family. Ask go him. Is Vic, is Vic chatting? When we was leave Vic, was Vic do mashing works on my own? your family him. member and then ask him. Shout out Rambo. Ask Rambo. Shout out Rambo. Shout out Rambo. Yeah, shout him out. That's, <laughs> that, that's the OG. Ask him. Mm-hmm. That's your OG. Yeah, he's my head. Definitely. Mm-hmm. He's my OG. Ask him. Awesome. See, let me ask you a question. See, coming up, yeah? Yeah, go on, bro. In turn, yeah? Who are the older, who are the man named, obviously, other than Rambo and and uh, Bugs and so forth, who are the other man named that could, that you could say that you looked up to? Because you went Joe Young. Mm, yeah, you very, very young. Very so, you young. see, when you went, that was just, um, you was just a missing person. Do you get it? <laughs> you were, did you get what yeah, I'm saying? It was a long time. It was a long time. Yeah, so, and then things doing. changed yeah. within that time. Yeah, of course it did. Now, when you were younger, mm. obviously, the fat peas on the rare, 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 but what other man from Turner would you say had influence to... Big up Jason. Your up. Big up Jason. Because uh, you still rate the I village. Think, I think, yeah, all the man... You see the village? Yeah. See more time you chat about the village? Yeah. See the village? The village is Turner. Yeah. For people that know, they know that's what they know, yeah, they, they know obviously. So yeah. I know you have a connection to this thing. You get what I'm trying mm. to say? So yeah, I'll just ask that. Like, who who would you say were your other... I think all the man them that was, I remember it was Goro season, so it's like all the man them that I think... Obviously, man will see it in turn them first before I hear who's doing it in Deptford or who's doing it wherever where else. You get what I'm trying to say to mm-hmm. you, but I think you got to remember, like, I live, I live on turn them out, I live on turn them out to the people that didn't know. So on the front line, that's that's my estate there. Above Jindy. Yeah, but yeah. above Jindy, that estate there. Yeah. So it's like. But, but for Jindy. So for me, it's yeah, like. Yeah, big up Jindy. <laughs> yeah, big up Jindy. Jindy got send out some drinks. Stink. Well, go on, Jindy. So because you got to remember, Turnham had we got John Stainer Primary School at the bottom of the bottom there. Big up my John Stainer. We had Hatcham Wood just over there, mm-hmm. and if you get to college, you just walk to go to Lucian College. So for ve- like my early like formative years, man didn't have to leave, leave Turnham, and you got you got you know t- you know um, Turnham Foundation, you know the primary school right there as well. You get me? Mm-hmm. So that was that was the zone. You went adventure, or you went to the creme, or you're chilling in Sector J, or you know what I'm saying to you, that, or you're in Kentwell. So th- th- those are the things. So I didn't really leave Turner because for me, that's why there's an attachment to it. Because I think, this is my personal opinion, there was a, like a, Turner was ostracized for the, from the rest of the borough. Yeah, 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 don't laugh, because you, you was in two different gangs. That's why you didn't, you didn't yeah. do that. Yeah. 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 Like, yeah. Like, yeah. I like that one still. Okay. He's he's a a I did like that one. Yeah. 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 He's a two different guy. Has he got me? Yeah. I'm a girl boy. Yeah. Yeah. I'm a girl boy from Brooklyn. Yeah. Yeah. They don't know what. I'm a girl boy from Brooklyn. You want to know what? Hey, let me do two games for Bugs with you. Yeah, the Bugs was a girl by the Brooklyn boy at the same time. I remember that still. He was a girl by the Brooklyn boy. But you know what? Back, you know what? Back then it was Bugs. Bugs could do what he wanted. So like, I'm here with that. Here what? Make this clear. Because man are trying to do some funny talking. Here what? Now, if we make this clear, I'm the bridge from Brooklyn to girl. So the whole link, with, the whole link with Turnham and the girl is me. I'm the bridge for that. <laughs> you I are, mean, but it's that, not, it's it was not still, even if. It's not even if. They were still selected, bro. You see, like, they were like, like, still no, selected, listen, though. Yeah, yeah, big man, there's no big see, man, yeah, in the room, yeah. That, that's the age group. Wait, 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 no, let me say something. This is what I'm saying, yeah? All right, cool. You see, you see Turnham now. This is what I'm saying. When you're saying Turnham was ostracized, yeah? Yeah, we were still. For me, there's two parts of Turnham. And I said this before, uh, I mean, you are there's the Eureka Road and there's Kemmel. How can that be? What are you talking about? That's how it about? works. What are you talking That's about? That's how it works. Yeah, That's how it works, bro. Okay. 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 Tell oh, no. me what I'm talking about. I've got anti that list. Do you know why that's not true? Let me tell you why. Do you know why that's not true? Let me tell you why. 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 Because man saying they can tell me why it's true. You can't tell me. I can definitely tell you why it's not true. I am the man. Like, I am the man. Yeah? Boom. So here what it is now. You see Eureka Road in that? I'm not going to mention them man's name. They're my brethren now. But there was tension between us. There was tension between Eureka Road and us. I, we've, had, we've had fights with them and fallouts in-house, in turn. So it was definitely two. We was here, they was there. We was, we was all right. We, bro, I can remember, stop, I can remember a time, them man, them man tried to chop out the back of my neck. 
tried to swing for the back of my neck. And Jimmy saved him. Jimmy didn't save me. Jimmy didn't save me. Jimmy didn't save me. Jimmy didn't save me. Hey, listen, listen. Jimmy didn't save me. Jimmy wanted to kick me out of his shop. I ran into Jimmy's and Jimmy said, why are you running in my shop? That's what Jimmy said. So, obviously, but remember this, you know, man, man's older than you. So you might not, when your time was, you might have saw it different. But for me and my ones, like me, Rambo, I'm not even gonna mention such man back there. Yeah. For for us lot, that's exactly how we saw turn. There's Eureka Road and there's the Kentwell lot. The venture, the venture community centre lot, and then there's the Eureka Road in them. Maybe so you never when you see say it like so when you say when you say they ostracized turn them, I can't see it as ostracized because all the man that you're talking about was coming Kentwell and linking the man them. They was in Kentwell with us. And that's facts. Hundred percent facts. Yeah, and do you know what it is? You see where you, you get maybe it's gonna be a different insight for you because number one, age group was different and you weren't there when you, you can't you can't remember when that Fam, situation no, happened, but you see before that situation yeah, happened, okay, was it still two sides or was turn and one? No, it's never you see what? You see what? listen. Alright, cool. Remember remember my remember my cousin Rambo, big him up. Me and him big him up, yeah? Them man are proper foundation turn. I, I live I live in Crofton. I, I'm coming over from Crofton into turn to link the man. Now, when I'm when I'm linking my cousins, it's always been that. Man said he don't like certain man and you know how it goes, like, yeah, them man there. And that's all that's what I know it to be. Mm-hmm. So I can't I can't sit here and your truth is your truth, but I have to tell my truth as well. Yeah no. Do you know right. what I'm saying? Like there's no separate. There's, so, no, there's no separate. There's no be, separation. If you come your behalf, though, yeah, I'm yeah, gonna yeah, say yeah, this. In my shit. generation, there was no separation, though. There you go. Turn them, turn them. Like there was you, no two parts of turn them. You was an active seventeen-year-old, and that's when you went to jail. You was active. Yeah. You get me. So you was fairly young when a lot of things were going on. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Even yeah. when you went to jail. Yeah. So they will still turn them after you had left. Yeah. And this is most probably where there's the misconstrued. You understand me? Because as I say, you was an active young seventeen-year-old. You weren't. Mm-hmm. Right. One second. So you see, right now, let, I'm gonna I'm gonna put it to you, yeah. Okay. You shot a video. Streets are broken, mm-hmm. right? Who from Kentwell Close was on Eureka Road? Most of that in video, your video. Most of that video shot in Kentwell. No, but when you did it on Eureka Road, you okay. Shot, so let me just say, no, let me just ask. Go ask it's not it's not a problem, but I'm just giving you an example because I'm saying to you, <laughs> like, who from Kentwell was on Eureka Road shooting that Bro, video? The whole borough was on Eureka Road when that video was being shot. We, like the video, it's on, it's on YouTube. So let me break something down to you. You see no Kenwell, man. My son, you see no who's Kenwell. When you say Ken, who's, when you say Kenwell, man, it's like your child is like Rusty. Um, shout out Rusty. Giga. Shout out Jigga. Um, my lot. Jigga, Jigga was a man we, as I well. Like this is what I'm saying. Stop, 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 <laughs> so you stop, see a separation. No, stop. Listen. I don't see Jigga as a Kenwell man. I don't see Jigga as a. What, what, you're separating things. So let me break it down. You see when you say Eureka Road, you're talking about one batch. You're talking about one batch when you say Eureka Road. That's the batch that man was in. Two families. Yeah, you're two talking about. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're saying you're yeah. talking about two families. Two families. One batch. Yeah. Hear what? Hear what? Out, you see what? This is where it comes into it now. It's, it's an age thing, isn't it? Because you see, you see the, you see there's, you see there's two families, there's two families on Eureka Road. Yeah. But one of them is a lot younger than the other yeah, one. Yeah. yeah facts. Yeah. So we're not. We're, I'm not. So who do you I think? Don't, I don't. Listen. You see what I'm saying? And this is what I'm saying. Yeah. Man ain't got, man's never had a problem so this with is what any I'm, of them. This is what I'm but you see the other ones? <laughs> man's definitely had a problem. No, with definitely. Definitely. So, ones, yeah. The older ones. So now check it out. So when I'm saying, so now connect the dots. When I'm saying J introduce me to Andy. I know who you're okay, talking cool. about. There I know exactly then. who you're talking about. There you go about. then. I know so exactly, cool. but that's so, my brother so, and I so, love him. You get what I'm saying to That's you. my brother so, and I love him. That's what I'm saying. So shout out Jay, so that's the link. So for me, I lived on Turnham House. So I'm, I am kind of like rode with indifferent to everyone in Turnham. So for me, I don't see a there difference. There was no separation. For me, there's no separation. So obviously my batch, Eureka Road, yeah, boom. My might be based there. But it's the same way I'd be based in an adventure or Sector J or whatever, whatever else. You get what I'm trying to say to you? Mm-hmm. So for me, Turnham was always the one. When I'm saying ostracized, this is the part you were trying to skip. Go on. Big man. Go on, let me ask you. Yes. <laughs> when I say ostracized, bro. There was no opportunities getting given to my generation from no one of an older generation. 
no one in the borough from an older generation wasn't given no, no fam you see that Listen. when I'm talking no 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 let, let me finish let me finish you see you're trying to create the escape hatch, the escape hatch. Mm. <laughs> I'm not gonna go to specify but the man yeah, know what I'm going to talk when man need bits and pieces talk nobody it was stone dry nobody came to us nobody it was ever like oh damn you saw that you get what I'm saying to you so guess what when I'm saying I had to tell my man to introduce me to that's how the route I had to go Right. So where was the rest of the older generation? So I'm saying, when I said turn was ostracized, because when you're seeing, when everyone was getting peds, to start with, we had to lick them. When everybody was, when everybody was doing certain other things, we had to do certain other things. That's why, that's why you know I'm saying to you. So there was no bringing to, and you can't. There was no. Right, cool. It's like my generation in turn was kind of like nobody's giving them not nothing. Mm, and that's why, there's a, that's why there's a different stock, there's a different what, energy. Do you think people wow. gave us stuff? You see, now you want to make a comparison. No, I'm just telling you. Like, I'm no, just but telling this you. is what I'm saying. Listen, you, you're saying you no, was wait, in wait, the middle. You, you not did let that stuff. You let definitely did. Let me finish here. Yeah. Yeah. Let me finish, you yeah. Definitely yeah. Did. Let me finish yeah. here. You're saying ostracized, yeah? yeah? You're saying no olders never gave us nothing. But yeah, none. Do you think we got given? Honestly, I'm asking you. Fam. Or, or do you think we did the same thing as Buzz. you and got brought on moves and them things? You can't deny that. Though, you can't deny that you was part of a conglomerate, bro. A strong conglomerate where access and resources. Of course I was. Yeah, access. <laughs> you see? You see? Okay. You're trying to go around it. Of where access and you had access to. You had access, access and resources easier. was different. Yeah. yeah you got, your access hey, roots yeah, are different listen, to mine. Listen, listen, listen. Yeah, but listen. Even at that age. No, no, no. Even at that age. See what? You see what? And I don't want to say this here, but this is what it is, isn't it? Man was out there putting in work. Man had, man, listen, man, no one ever gave man nothing. Man went and took it. Man was out there taking it. So, okay, so you don't look after it. So what about the younger generation coming up? Well, they have to go through the exact same thing then? That's what you're saying? Yeah! It's struggle built character. What are you talking about? Struggle built my character. Why won't it do yours? That's what I mean by ostracized. <laughs> no, you weren't ostracized. That's what I'm saying. That's a strong word. I mean a, that's a strong that's word, bro. Ostracized is a big, big word, you know? Yeah, no, nah, there was there was a there was a set there was a certain energy. You know, what, you, know you know what kind of energy you're giving me right now? You're giving me entitlement energy. You know? <laughs> you're giving me bare entitlement. It's like I feel like I feel like you're saying like you man got money, so you have to pop off on me. What are you talking about, black? Like, go get that. You see, look, that's the road. No, but that's, that's what he's showing you. No, so the man the never made him get it. So you he found Jay. Jay lines him up that's and made cool. him get, man, man, get his own bread. Listen, man ain't knocking that. I man get it. Man ain't knocking <laughs> you that. You know what I'm saying? I get it. That's why you never like wanted to feed You don't never wanted to, you know what I'm saying? So man had to read him. And then when I'm now, when I'm rolling with him, and I'm getting things done, now man want to talk about I want to rule. Hold on a minute. You might be giving my mouth. Exactly. I get it. There you go. Are you not mad? Do you know what kind of people we grew up on though? You see? You, listen, yeah, wait, man, no, wait, 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 no, wait, 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 who remembers it? Huh? Who knows what? Even who even knows what I'm talking about? Huh? Is that Mazda? Yeah, Mazda. Does man remember? Does, 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 does man remember? Does man remember the silver MX5? Come on. 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 Come yeah, facts. We grew up differently, black people. We was coming to take it. The man, them, my friends. <laughs> the older ones, my friends. Oh, oh, they were coming to take it. My friends. You see? You get me, the man, them. The man, them. But they would take off a man as well. <laughs> you talking like, yeah, talking yeah, like yeah, I'm talking yeah, any different. Like, I, I'm not going to mention nobody's name. But this is what I'm saying, like. The, the, like, yeah, but that's not. You see the ostracized thing? Yeah. Man, the reason why I'm saying that is because man didn't look on it like how you're looking on it. Man look on it like, raw. We're in it. This is us. Him, he can tell you, he can tell you, we was in it together, we'll go and get it. Fuck anybody else. We don't need nobody else. We've got our circle, we can go and get it. Hey, can I ask you a question? Was that without the bridge being built? You see the bridge that you got? Was that without it? <laughs> Why? I'm asking you a question. I'm allowed to ask a question. When man getting it, when man getting it, when man getting it before the bridge was built? Uh, or did the bridge help man get it? All right. Be honest. Let me let me say something. <laughs> Boom. No, you know what? You know what I'm gonna say. You see, you see the first grands man ever saw. That was solely man. I, I took no, not I'm lying. Piece of the bridge. Fat Pete, no, nothing to do, nothing to do with the bridge. Fat Pete, big up Pete. Big up Pete. Yeah, he has to man. get big up. Big up Fat Pete. 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 Pete.
they put the first grands and racks that man saw. The first time man went west with racks in their pocket, it's because of them, man. And if you know what the man then was doing, then this is what I'm saying. The man was out there doing madnesses. I'm not mentioning no names or nothing, but man was robbing train stations, bro. Early. Early. Man was robbing Early. train stations <laughs> to get money, bro. Early. It's not like anybody was giving, man. And if you know the madness, what we was doing to get into the train station, to get the money, remember, how do you get into a train? How do you get behind a train station, camera? Oh, mad. How do you get behind it? Are you saying Bradleys and Brinkleys? How do you get, how do you get behind a train station, camera? They're all glassed up, there's no doors. How do you get behind it to get the money? Tell us. Blood, man was running in there with paving slabs and breaking glass. Mad. <laughs> and climbing through. So that's how man was, you see like, the ostracized thing. Man didn't look to nobody for nothing. Because man was going to get it for themselves. Man was really to get the cut. He's twisting it. He's twisting it. Man, this is what I'm saying. I'm not twisting it. Oh, blood. Cool you cool just sat here and said, I'm just we got it and we didn't want to get to you. So I'm just saying, blood. The people before I'm us were saying, saying, you see like all them spuds. You mentioned spud. Yeah, spud was getting it. Spud didn't give you nothing. He's still shouting, isn't it? My first, my first set of grams. I hear that. Okay, cool. Spud never give me no grams. Don't Big up Spud, same way, I love him. Don't say but a word. But he never give me no grams. So you see, to clear up this thing, yeah? That you never saw no separation in Turnham. Nah, there's no separation. Mm. Like, I don't, there's no part of Turnham that I don't know. Like, and the that's maybe hand. because you never had the issue, obviously the same issue. As the nah, the that, issue. that would have created, that would have created a separation. No? Yeah, like, nah, never, nah, never, them same, never them same issue. man, them never same man, issue. them same man that we used to, I won't even say beef, but we had ill feelings towards. Mm-hmm. I love them, man. Mm-hmm. You get it? Like, straight up and down. I, I got so much love for the both of them. That same family that we're talking about, I got love yeah, for the always, both yeah, of them. Always, man. Always. So it's not like, it's just always. like a kiddish thing. When we was young, it was rivalry. They was down there, we was up here. Yeah, no, definitely. Them man there, definitely. It's always big up but to them. I can understand. They showed, they showed me a lot of my first, yeah, You see I'm where you're saying, like, it wasn't that for you. I can understand you're cool with both sets, so you wouldn't see the divide. Mm. Mm. Do you get? Mm. You're cool with both. You're, you go, okay. you're cool. You just, you won't see it. But for us, it was that's clear. what it was. I, Oh, well, at least we've cleared out then, isn't it, lads? Hey? <laughs> <laughs> I respect it the same way, trust me. Yeah, let's get off all of this gang stuff, man. Positive times. So, Vic, when you get me in the film, blood, Carl, Carl, <laughs> I need an actor. Now, Vic, role. now, there's a positive story that you need to tell, yeah? Mm. Now, there was an issue with you and a certain person on the, in the end, yeah? Mm. Now, this issue became public. Mm-hmm. Went, went on the internet. People mm. knew about this issue. Mm-hmm. Can I get, can I get a brief? Because I don't know what you're talking about. Stop. Don't know. Stop. Now, now calibrate your this brief. issue, from what I know, passed from the past. This issue could have really gone left, yeah, mm-hmm. or really gone right. And this issue was put to bed, mm-hmm. okay, without none of these things happening. Mm-hmm. Oh, okay, okay, okay. I got you. Can you speak about the positive? side of this issue being able to be put to bed please because that's something that i feel a lot of people would like to know they knew about it so it's not behind the door thing it was Mm. out there Mm -hmm. and i believe that yeah i would like to 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 you get me yeah no definitely i think like it's one of those situations where with anything you have to choose to take positives out of it otherwise you're going to be left with a perspective that you can't live with so, for example, one of the things that happen consistently, I've seen generation after generation, is two people would have an issue, and the intensity don't necessarily generate just between them two. Is the people from around them, the 100%. people staring the pot. Show me that red thing there, please. Yeah, the people, the people that staring the pot. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. What always happens is these people are vultures. Yeah, I'm gonna speak on them first, and I'll get into that because these are the people that sit there, stare the pot, throw their two pence in. But they're the people that you're not gonna pick up nothing and go and kick it. You're not gonna do nothing. And when he goes left, you're not gonna you're not gonna contribute to no funerals or you're not gonna send nobody no postal orders. And then these people move on to another situation and keep up the same thing. I I respect that. So these people are vultures. Secondly, the situation you're talking about with the positives of it, I wanna just I wanna t- you wanna not know how it ended? Wait, wait. Wait, can you explain that? I'm listen, like I'm you see, no, no, there. listen, I'm there. I'm there. There. you see if I didn't know what was going on, the, the people, the people them that you're talking to definitely don't know what you're talking about. Yeah, so you, have to, you have to make them understand this story because right now the story is just... So, I had, so basically, you got to look at it like this. Again, from the, very, from the very beginning, I had an issue with this person. He knew I had an issue with it. I made, him, I made it clear I had an issue. He made it clear that he had an issue. 
Right? Are you going to mention his name so they can know or, or not? You I'm a dude. Feel free to you mention like, the name. I'm yeah, gonna, you feel free to mention you're the name. Not you're not doing it? You're going to do it. Me and I do it neither. I'm crazy. What are you going to do? My wife jacked me and I told me there's no idea. What's it going to do? It's a household name from our end, you get me? Yeah, because here's the thing I about believe it. it as that. Yeah, for the people that know, they know, innit? So obviously, this is where the questions are deriving from, mm-hmm. innit? So we had an issue, he knew about it. Now, here's the thing about it. You talked about this gap. I'm in jail from 17, 28. So there was a big portion of people that, A, don't even know who I am. B, is not even aware of whatever, whatever not. So when something like that happens, the pot is stirred harder because you're looking at one person like, who is my You're man? new. You just dropped Yeah, yeah, sky. you're looking at me like... With no research. This guy just dropped from yeah, the sky. Yeah, I'm saying to you. And now he's in our ends. The situation ended with a phone call, a phone conversation. And how we got to that phone conversation is something, again, that doesn't really happen. I'd been, we'd been in a period where it's like, it's been, for me anyway, it felt so head and head, like something has to happen. That's how I felt at that time. So I was in an event, rest in peace to Jamal Edwards. I was in an event. I'm in there. And I think that was the first time in my life, I think me and him, I could say we've been in the same place together. Mm-hmm. So the moment I see him, I think to myself, okay, cool. Based on the dialogue, Adjust it. This, is just the, this is the moment. I go outside, they said I can't come back in, cool. So I just wait outside. There were people from the ends that were there that day, at that event, it wasn't Shoreditch. I'm standing outside waiting. Mm-hmm. When, people realize, when people are walking and realize I'm waiting outside, they go inside to see he's in there, you can kind of put two and two together. Mm-hmm. So now this is where the conversations start happening. And this is going back to the people that stayed apart. There were a lot of people there that day. And here's the thing about it, where it's like, there was nothing at no point that was stopping. This is why I look at the older generation. I've got no respect, like, not the minister, no respect, because I'm not a person I have no respect. I have little regard for people of a certain generation in this borough that fold their arms and watch things and watch the chaos when I believe they could play a bigger role in terms of, like, mediating. Mm-hmm. But nobody doesn't because it's, there's no precedence for it. It's, mm-hmm. like let the, it's like let the chaos just take off. Fire. So anyway, so we are in that place now. I'm outside, I'm there on a certain type of time, he's inside. So for, in my head, it's just, this is where this is where the meet happens. This is the middle of the day in Shoreditch. Mm-hmm. People start walking in, seeing that, and you can look at a man outside, see the mode, you know, you know what I'm saying to you? Mm-hmm. So now man's, in the, now man's in the rave trying to create a conversation. Like, okay, cool, like, bro, you don't need to talk. And the man's ringing me like, yo, boom, you need to, yo, it's hot, you need to leave. After I'm not leaving, this guy's gonna... Do it. So now the conversation start happening. Long short, it ends up in, yeah, what, you, he's gonna get on the phone with you, you lot can get on the phone together, bro, what not. Next day, a man linked a man, got on the phone. And then that's when the initial conversation happened. And off the back of the initial conversation, without well, even going into it, I'm only gonna reference one thing. Because people have these narratives, again, I hear the narratives of, A, you, oh yeah, my man, this one rang this one and to squash it or this one and people try to make either party look some type of way for the idea of peace for the people that are looking for the entertainment. Mm-hmm. Number one, that's the most powerful thing that could happen. Mm. Yep. Two men having a conversation. But you got to remember like, I'm not in a place in my life where my definition of a person is what I'm leading of. I lead from a standpoint of defending myself. Mm-hmm. You put me in a situation, I got to defend myself, I'm going on to my children. You get what I'm trying to say to you? Mm-hmm. That's just my mentality. One of the only point I, I'm going to touch on the conversation when he said to me, you know what I'm on, everyone knows what I'm on, but you move like you want to see it happen. And I had to explain to him, I come off the roads when I came out of jail. I'm not on this, I'm not out here trying to push badness. You see my family, I'm a Jew, I'm a light in my family. All my, all my, all my siblings look up to me. Yeah, my mum, everybody. So you see when you threaten someone like me, you threaten my whole family, brother. At that point, it's not about badness. I'm in a place in my life where I'm not dealing with that. When you, when you threaten someone like me, you've just threatened to take the light out of my whole family. At that point, I react in the enemy necessary type of mindset. It's never about I think you're not this or I think you're not that. The definitions mean nothing at that point. Do you get what I'm trying to say to you? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. And I believe he understood that statement in that moment. And we were able to establish that, okay, cool, it's not about being friends. But you go your way, I go mine, this, that, and, and, and that was the end of it. Now, what follows after that for the people that want to see entertainment or fireworks is like, oh, who did what and who made what call? Who said what? Who did mm-hmm, it? But that's irrelevant, mm-hmm, number mm-hmm, one. Mm-hmm. Number two, I'm a sincere youth. So if I jump on a call with you right now, we've had phone calls, us three, mm-hmm. and we discuss the issue mm-hmm. and we said that's that, that's that in my heart. Yeah. 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 And you are that person. I, I agree. So when I came over the phone in my man, that's that. So when I hear any narratives or stories or whatever, not again, I don't feel the necessity to clear it because he knows what happened and I know what happened. And that's all that really matters. But that situation was put to bed and 
that was one of the most powerful things that could happen because believe it or not, he was at a spot where he was willing to do whatever and I was at, we, was, we was at a place where we had the exact same intentions. Mm -hmm. And for to see that come to close with a conversation, that's one of the most powerful things I've witnessed. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You get what I'm saying? That's one of the most, and on top of that, let me talk further to that. My man's a Muslim, you get what I'm trying to say to you? I'm happy he really went like that, in that moment. For the, for the brothers that are watching, they know what I'm talking about. You get what I'm saying to you? I'm happy he went like that in that moment. And that's one of the most powerful things that, that, could, that could ever happen. So for me, it's like, I pay no attention to whispers or pe the narrative people say, I heard this happen, I heard that happen, I heard that happen. Like, I, that's where it ended. It ended in the middle of I'm standing outside, you're standing, you're inside, and this is this is this, like it's either we're gonna meet here face to face, and or we're gonna. And I think God intervened in that situation, mm -hmm. and we had a conversation on the phone, and that was it. And we ain't spoke since. I rate that. And I this is what I rate that. Four years ago, five years ago. So even when I hear of the topic, for me, look how much the world has changed in the last four or five years. <laughs> look how much has changed. Look, look how much has changed in, in the last four or five years. It's benign to me that the amount of things I've done in the last four or five years. And even and even, still even in the this. end, and it still and always still comes back to it. Which just only lets me know people okay. want the entertainment, people want to see the fireworks, people want to. So here's the thing about it: I'm okay with somebody that doesn't know me having the wrong opinion about me because you don't actually know me. Mm -hmm. So you can actually think the wrong thing. I'm not triggered by these type of things. I don't go sleep thinking of it's like who, who said that or they they don't know me. And on top of that, I'm a person that's only going to read someone from when I meet you in person. So I could hear everyone in the room be saying something about me. For example, if I come in the room and nobody has that energy of that. I'm going to leave with that sincerely. So when someone comes to me and says, no, so so and so, 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 I'm going to be like, no, I, but I saw him the other day. So it's not really like that. So that's how I deal with it. It's got to be based on real, it's got to be based on, based on real time. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So I dis, I'm, so I'm saying to you, so for me, like, I don't be focusing on the things that put me in a negative mind state. Mm -hmm. I don't be focusing on the type of things you get what I'm trying to say oh, to you. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And I think it, for all the young people that got situations, a lot of the things that happen and it goes left is because conversations don't happen. There is no dialogue. It's like, I'm, I'm, I'm a wicked man, you're a wicked man. We got to see where the wickedness goes. Mm -hmm. So let's break it down now. What point is there to prove? So, okay, so it's like, really what you're checking is you got to prove to the next man you're more stupid than he is. Yeah, hundred. I, I got to prove to you that I'm more that. stupid than you are. Is I hear this, that. So, and that's the metrics of measurement. I, hear that. I got to prove I'm more stupid than you are because regardless it's of what really happened, gotta happen. yeah, nobody wins. That's the reality mm -hmm. of it. I've sat in there, I've walked in the tunnels, I've sat in themselves, I've did A, cat, cat A, B downwards, I've been maximum security, I know what goes on in there. I know what a life has faced really looks like five years into your sentence, 10 years into your sentence. I know what happens on the visit where your youth is first running up to you when you first go in, now your youth is walking up to you, the next minute he doesn't want to come on the visit. I've Facts. seen those, 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 those transitions of the people that, you know what I'm trying to say to mm -hmm. you, so, so for me, I don't, I focus, I base my decision making on my experience and the things I've seen in life are not on, the mind and perspectives of people that don't that have they don't have the lived experience that I do. You get what I'm saying to you. So that's, that's what I base my decisions on. Let me ask you a question. I rate that. You see the importance of even what you're just saying. You see for the younger generation coming up here, yeah, I feel like you need to they need to understand the importance of as you said, just a conversation. Because I won't lie to you, it's like no one wants to stop until it's gone wrong. Mm -hmm. It's all fun and games till it's not fun and games no more. Yeah, but yeah. the problem is like yeah. what you said, you see what you said? The problem is that, like what you said, the older people that are leading them, that can have a, even 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 like let's say for, I'm not I'm just gonna use two areas. Let's just make up Shoreditch and Belvedere. There's youths there, and then there's older ones. Now the older ones from Shoreditch and the older ones from Belvedere, they're cool, but they're youths are beefing. Mm. I think that's it's sick. for the oldest to step in mm. and squash it, but. That's not happening. Which right could here. be done with a conversation that's as that man's happening. just showing. That's what you just said, but mm -hmm. that's not happening out here. No, you gotta realise, listen, man's gotta remember, yeah? Man's gotta remember the fact, yeah. A man who's doing road full time, like on this road, gang banging, he's not he his head's not copus momentous. He's not thinking straight. Yeah. So it's all good saying you're gonna have a conversation with a man. But if a man can't comprehend what the conversation's gonna say, where's it going? Hey. Where's it going? Oh, hey. And remember, you know, it's all good. We can see it now, but I can tell you this. There was a time in my life when none of you could tell me nothing about anything what I was doing. No one couldn't tell me anything. This, this, where I am now is part of my growth. Mm. It's part of me growing up. Mm. Where I can have a conversation with a man. I can listen to a man talk or whatever. So you have to understand that it's not a straightforward, it is. It, it would be a straightforward as having this conversation. Be. It can be. But it can't be. But that's why there has to be leaders though, innit? Within the community, innit? They can't just be, everyone can't just make it, making it like, because for me growing up, I felt like it was senseless. 
again, that role still didn't exist. Do you get what I'm trying to say to you? It's easy to just mind your business because we grow like that. It's like, just mind your business, carry on with what you're doing. Yeah, but the, and facts, stay, and stay the, facts, is, the facts is, a bad man ain't gonna respect a good boy. No, but, but, but that's define, the facts of it. But define so, bad, so is, now this, is, now this that's the badness I'm talking about. What is badness? What is badness? This is what I'm saying to you. Are you who's on the road keeping up badness? What's badness? He's out there gang banging, stabbing, whatever. I'm not even talking about making money because making money is hustling. I don't see hustling as badness. You've got everybody's got to make money, you know. But if you're out here, you're living a gang banging lifestyle. Wherever I'm a gang member, I'm brew, I'm dying for mine, whatever. A man can't come and talk to you about that. A man can though, bro. Because there's lifers on the wing that are listeners, bro. What are you after, talking about? After, after listen, after right, they got I, life. Judy has got the, a fucking... Hey, hey, you see that Judy rapper? Right, wait, wait, he's, got wait, a, he's, got, he's got a lyric here yeah, that's tough. Yeah. Man's like, talking about he knows a lifer. He knows lifers in jails that are sausages. And it's true talk. A lifer don't make you the bad boy. Bro, there's lifers listen, in jail right said, now that are regretting their crime. Listen to what I said. Listen to what I said. If a man is on badness, mm. if a man's out here repping his flag and he's saying to you, I'm dying for my flag, go and talk to him then. Go and have a conversation bro, with that person right now, who's in that mind frame of this is my flag and I'm dying for it. You go and talk to him. No, bro. man hear you, yeah? Man's not saying, man's not disagreeing with what you're saying. Man's saying, man can tell that guy how his story ends. Of course, bro. That, that's what it is then. People have told him. That's what it is, no, but, but, but this is what I'm so, saying. So man's whether not gonna not, stop telling him. I'm saying, whether or, not I'm saying. Man, whether, whether or whether or not a man can comprehend it is a whole different thing. It's all good talking, you know, but if it falls on deaf ears, that conversation was a waste of time. That's why there's a time and place for everything, innit? Do you understand what I'm so, saying? Is, like, the, the youths them out here now, I'm a big advocate to tell the youths them, it's a waste of time, blood. Gang banging ain't getting nowhere, nobody ain't making no money, all your friends are gonna die, go to jail, it's all long. We all know the story, we all know it. We've been through it. But at, the, at a point in your life, there is a time when a man can't tell you nothing. Yeah. Nothing. Man could tell me nothing. Tell but me I'm lying. I, I, I hey, what? Could a man tell you anything? Yeah, but... You, could, no, a man, that's true. could a man tell you anything? You Listen, hey, sorry. I would have died for you, you would have died for me. That was it. That's just all it was. I didn't see any further than that. So I wasn't able to comprehend. Even when a man's saying to me, you're gonna dip or end up in jail. You're nuts, I'm a bad man, I can't die. So let me ask you a question then. You did learn though. Of course I learned. How? Hindsight. Life. Life's, life's the biggest teacher. But t let me say something to you. 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 I'm a lucky one. I'm, I'm one of the lucky ones. Break that down. I'm, I'm a stab up. My guts was hanging out. I nearly dead. And I was still going banging after that. So that that don't even make sense still, I didn't, I didn't. Idiot. <laughs> <laughs> that don't even make, this one's here. It don't even make sense, blood. I grew up, I'm gonna say growth. I, like I had to grow. Cause so, it was- So do you know that you're the perfect person to tell the, the person that's gang banging right now that that growth eventually comes through like, harsh life blood, lessons? It's gonna cost money. I'll talk to all the youths, but you gotta pay me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow. I've got kids. I've got kids that need nights and prodies. So it's just, it's just, it's, just, it's, just, it's gonna cost money, yeah. The youth, but the point is, you would talk, you would talk. Yeah, I'll talk to all of them. So well, I'll show you how mad it was. I'll show you how mad it is. When I came out of jail, when I came out of jail, the first, the first, like within the first probably two months, when I was on pro when I was in the Mapa hostel and I was on probation, right? I got a gig at a Woodage school. One of my brethren's got me a gig in the Woodage school to go and talk to these youths about all the gangbanging and all that stuff. And you know what probation done? Told me if I go back to the school, they're gonna recall me. Yeah, that's crazy. That's my practice. That's, that's mad. That's my practice. That's hey Vic, I wanna ask you a question, yeah? See where you went, Joe, at such a young age, yeah? yeah See, well, coming back out to where it ends that you're not fully familiar with, no more. Mm. Things have changed, people's come, people's gone. Has there ever been a time where you felt alienated in these ends, coming home? Nah, never. I think the game's the game, innit? So it's like the game was always gonna be the game, the players was gonna change. So in terms of like, when I came out of jail, I was on license, I had to be in Lucian anyway. So it's like, that's number one. And I used to like, always feel like, I can't wait till I get away from the ends, get away from the ends, this, that, and the third. But it's like, everything's about timing. Cause when I did get away, it was too early and then it's just like, I'm just out of my, out of my zone and then mm -hmm. traveling back on with the probation, et cetera, et cetera. But yeah, you know, I don't think I ever felt alienated. I think with any situation, right? Like if you're talking about the earlier periods of coming out back to like when, you know, there's still issues going on. Mm -hmm. I know naturally when two big characters have an issue, one people fall on one side, other people fall on whatever side. And if you've been in those situations already before, you just know how you have to move in those periods. Mm -hmm. You just know how you have, you know how you and your people have to carry it. So it's like I think, but it didn't make 
me feel alienated because I lived in Lewisham the whole time. Because mm-hmm. I, so I used to live, I used to live in Grove Park the whole time, and mm-hmm. I lived in um, in, in Lewisham way the whole time. Mm-hmm. You know, I only really moved that when the whole thing was over. Mm-hmm. So, okay, cool. so I, I was in Enzo the whole time. But yeah, so nah, definitely it was it was alright. But I think it was different in the sense of just the new buildings and the new. Days I'm gonna challenge you. I'm gonna challenge you to something, you know, because you're a man who sets up all these things. You got. You got the thing underneath the lights in in in, in West End and all that, yeah. So I put you for it, man. We all kick it and talk to them. I do it for free. You see, I'm glad. You, I'm glad you brought that put, up. Put, 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 put your money where your mouth is. I'm glad. I'm glad you brought that up. I'm gonna. You can sign up. So basically, why well, don't I, I sign up? I should be one of the keys. I'm bad. <laughs> yeah, so I'm telling you, like I got something for you for people for you. So basically, a couple of years ago, I think about five years ago. I set up the ex-offenders forum in it. The ex-offenders forum basically the idea came from the from the fact that when I came out, I just felt like probation couldn't give me the information I needed. It's like I, I feel like there was a disconnect. There was a disconnect in like what they thought was going on and what was really going on, right? So the people I could get information from is next. Maybe it's, it's a next job month. to them. Yeah, it's next it's a month. Job to them. Yeah, you know, when you came out, how did you put on your yard or how did you put on? It's a job to them, hundred percent. So it made me start thinking. If you have an ex ex offenders forum in place, so which is why I set it up. So basically, it was people like yourselves and myself mm-hmm. to like be like a. I'm trying to get accredited at the moment, so man can be like a gateway for when man come out of jail. For example, probation could just refer you to the ex offenders forum. Okay. And then where you're dealing with man that we're, we're going to be talking your language and telling you how it really is. Mm-hmm. Not no textbook stuff. Mm-hmm. You get what I'm saying to you? You're going to be getting the truth, the raw truth and it's up to you to choose what to go and do with it because the support is even more because you, you know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. So that's something i got at the moment. I'm trying to get accredited. I'm holding you to How would it come yeah. through? On a form as a phone? Like a... No, so like basically, a, you know how probation makes referrals and stuff. So mm-hmm. what I can do is once it's accredited, then you get... Yeah, once it's accredited... You get oh. into prisons to get into their resettlement program mm-hmm. where it's like, okay, you can be part of the ex-offenders forum when you get... Out, da, 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 and they'd have resources because basically, I, I've got a network at the moment of like ex-offenders that have come home and done mad, you know, amazing things with their lives. You know, from people, women that came out of women prisons, from men that came out, you know what I'm saying? Because the statistics always show you're going to re-offend within the first year. You ain't got no chance. You ain't got no this, that, and the third. You, yeah, you're going to get recalled on your license. It's true. But there are people that came out and didn't get recalled and do businesses and stuff. So oh, no, no. man's got these people also involved in it. So when a youth comes out or anybody comes out, you can come and see man and you ain't got to watch face. You can tell man, yo, like it's hard. Man ain't got nothing. Like you ain't, because man's been through it. Mm-hmm. You get what I'm saying mm-hmm. to you? So man can give you real sort of survival sort of like advice based on what man's been found. Also help you support your stuff with the normal stuff like how you get a job and did it because a lot of man came out and got qualifications and went on to work. So something like that, you can come and be yeah, one yeah, of the yeah. main members of it. All right, me, and be it? Part, yeah. of, part of the whole thing. Yeah, I can come and give and some anyone experience. else that wants to be involved, anybody that wants to come and share their stories because I think that's important for the like, because you can come out of jail and kind of feel like you're the only one going for it. Because everyone's at the gates when you come up, like, yeah, hey, welcome home. This, that, and the third. And a couple of days after, everyone's back to their normal lives. Come on. <laughs> you just deal with these new trainers <laughs> that everyone's <laughs> bought you. Hey, you know what I'm at? No veggies. Hey, everyone's you know at man, work. A man dropped me a draw every day for a week. And then after the week that I phoned him for a draw, a man said, yeah, your time's done. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't got no more for you. <laughs> you know that was, not it? <laughs> So yeah, so my, so the ex yeah, yeah, was yeah, over. Yeah. It's over. Yeah, it was over. Yeah, yeah, it was over. Yeah, it was over. Yeah, it was over. So yeah, it was over. over. Yeah, man. I'm, Except for the forum, real. definitely I'm something get, get involved in that. You see what? I'm all for. I'm all for helping the youth as much as I can. I was joking about that money thing. I'm all for. Helping I hope you was. <laughs> <laughs> man, start talking about Prada and Nex. That's what the need. That's what the youth don't want. That's what the youth them asking for. But don't watch that. I'll help the youth them for free. Not for free, but yeah, yeah, for free. Man's got to pay for me to get there. <laughs> yeah, I'll, I'll be there. It's a travel expense, yeah. Yeah, travel expense, man. I'll be there, travel expenses. You get me? No, that's big, though. That's something big that you're doing still. Have you brought in Tricky? Hey, Tricky's my guy, man. Definitely, he's going to be involved. Tricky's my guy. He's going to be involved. I need, I need all that. I got this thing out, you know, there's a segment of it called Celebrating the Survivors. You see, when I see a man from the old days, for example, I've known you over 20 years. I've known you 20 years, so it's like, I'm just happy to see the survivors. I know you gave me certain man in there. I've known you know. that. Like, I'm just when I see and a survivor. It's not just death. It's mental health. It's mental it's health. Everything. It's life itself. Children. Everything. Transitions. Hundred percent. I'm seeing them, and I'm like, yo, I'm not meant for twenty. Years. Well, I'm just happy to see you on your storm two feet, guarding. Hundred percent. You get what I'm saying to you? Because it's not easy out here. It's, Never. It's, it's not easy out here. So, so you got to celebrate the survivors, man. Definitely, man. That's 100%. what man's got to just try and keep good energy all the time. You know that. I'm not even gonna lie though. Like I really wanted to talk about the rated awards. <laughs> <laughs> I'm 
Trust me, we did speak about it. No, we didn't, man. <laughs> but I'm gonna, leave, I'm gonna leave it there anyway, because... I try and tap, tap at the door again. <laughs> yeah. Right, yeah, so anyway, what happened? So what happened? So what happened, innit? Because man won. You no. went with him, yeah? We're gonna talk you about off camera. We're gonna talk about off camera. You do the off camera thing. <laughs> Man might record you secret recording. Like, yeah, I've, I've been trending on the blog. So, <laughs> nah, I'm only dropping probation calling me the next day. So you was where? When what oh, happened? Oh yeah, <laughs> man. <laughs> Probation's like I'm like I wasn't there. So yeah, for the, I was not knowing. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. It wasn't, was you? Yeah, the, home, the home office will love that little story. Yeah. So oh, yeah, so you was there, yeah. You are IPP, isn't it? EPP. EPP. Oh, okay, okay, okay. When does that come? When when does that all stop? Hopefully, don't soon. know if I should tell the people. Don't tell no one. Don't tell no one. Don't don't Keep that to yourself, because people, because you're going to know still. You see the one thing about it, like, yeah, man, I, yeah, one thing you can guarantee with certain man people hate. at certain ends. Man will try and get, get you in trouble. get you back in on your EPP. Yeah, just, <laughs> just, just know, yeah, man's been walking the line still. Just know that man's been walking the line. Like, you're yeah. I'm almost there. Let me tell you something. I'll give, give you your flowers where you need to get your flowers, yeah? Like, I spoke about it before. You're a BAFTA award winner, yeah? You, you, you've pushed your music. Yeah, Facts. like you have pushed your thing. You understand me? Blood and your work it. rate is it films? It, your work rate is mad. So you see that man have to give you from a person that knows you from a young boy that went to school with you. I have to give you your flowers, yeah, brother. I appreciate that because brother. you talk the thing and you try to go. You not even try. You go for what you're saying you're going for. Mm. Yeah, and I don't think that enough credit is given to you for that because I've said this. You see, if everyone was to come together, mm. yeah, you see the next blue movie or the true blue story or whatever. There's not. It's not going to be done quicker than being under the umbrella all with man. Mm. Do you understand? Mm. So you can help push these stuff like to where they need to go to. You can help get certain things done because of the position you stand in. Yeah. Do you understand that? Yeah, on, so I will give you your flowers for that. You've gone out, you've networked, you're everywhere. Your friends are everywhere. You've got <laughs> friends everywhere. Bad man friend, non-bad man friend, you're just out there with them. So you understand? I see that and I have to respect you for, for, for that. Fair and you do, it, you do it more time alone. You no. just see Vic you know what? up with a new bridge in from, you know what? from fucking <coughs> Shrewsbury. Man said Shrewsbury. R- 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 Vic's just rolling with him. You understand? So yeah, I respect yeah. that. You, you, you make connections where you need to make them. So I respect that. Nah, come on, man. I appreciate that. Nah, you, see what, you see what you've done? I'm going to be real, yeah? I was, I, last, time I went, last time I was in jail, I was in jail with you. I came home 2.14. I don't, when did you come home? 2.15? 2.15, yeah. All right, cool. So you see what you've done in the eight years mm. that you've been home? I have to take my hat off to you. You've been, you've won a BAFTA, like he said. You've been in films, you've you've signed to a label, you've got your own record label, you're, you've intent, you've numerous roles, mm. like numerous things, you get me? Big yourself up. No, nah, come on, man. And I'm you not, don't I'm push not, negative. I'm not, I'm not bigging you up on no street shit. I'm, you this don't is some, push negative. This is some grown men positive shit. This, nah, ain't, come on. this ain't nothing to do with the roads or nothing like that. This is like, what I've seen you do since you come home, I don't know many men that have done it. Nah, come on, I appreciate that. And that's real. That's real talk. And you don't push fuckery. Yeah, nah, I don't get to yeah. oh, Sometimes he does, blood, because he was on the internet talking mad. Speed, come and leave me now. That was a long time. Speed, come and leave me now. I get that. That was all in the I don't that. need to train. I don't need to train for eight weeks, blood, up tomorrow. Last time, last time I killed the phone, and this one, what is that? Uh, everyone, has, everyone has moments, blood. Yeah. 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 That was easy, man. That, man, that, that was... Man, I had to learn the hard way, though. Trust me. Yeah, I had to learn it. the hard I way. I respect it. I respect it still, so... No, trust me. Now, come on, man. You lot as well. Big a lot, like I said, Last time I came here, you lot was using phones to film this. So, nah, nah, nah. Man, I don't chat my <laughs> Chatting my business, blood. Nah, nah, nah. Yeah, you know what I mean? Nah, the man that's got all like 10 cameras. The secrets. The man that's got all 10 like, cameras. What? There's all types of things going on. Nah, I'm like, yeah. The phone nah, battery ain't dying. Nah, nah, nah. Like, the person that phone battery ain't dying. <laughs> see this guy? <laughs> nah, nah, listen. I like, respect it. Big, listen, this mm. is what I'm trying to say to you. Man will still pull up. Even if a man had one camera, I know this. Yeah, come on. Where two, where man and take the energy is the this. same every come single, on. every single come time. On. I know this because everything is. Yeah, you know, I'm trying to say because that's the only way. If we don't anchor, it, we know each other like that. Then what's the point? Fam? One million. And you know what the wickedest thing is, yeah. As as elders on the block, yeah, all of us, yeah, every man, every man can look here and rare, rare, rare. But it's exactly what he said. Man's supposed. Man's not supposed to be pushing no negative because you know what, man, I got kids. 
and you see like how a man's pushing, you might not even push negative on your kid. You're, you got a youth next to you. He's not your youth, your youth's good. Your youth's guy in school, he plays with all these good school friends. You got this little bad youth around you, you're a bad man, you're an old man machine. Rare, rare, rare. He ends up in the dance with your youth. And mm. a straight bullet hits your youth. These are all things that can really happen in life. And things like that have been happening. Do you understand? Facts. So like, man are supposed to be out here as a collective pushing positive for the youths then, straight up. I no, can't facts. say it, I can't say it more clearer than that. Cause bullets don't know no, bullets don't have no name. Yeah, you understand? Man, man has to represent man. Like, and I think, you know, that's just the energy it has to be otherwise. What's, otherwise, what, like what you're talking about, like when some of got teenage kids, you get what I'm saying to you, my son, when Blackie fun fed out, that was almost like my heart, my anxiety was 100%. doing, doing rollies. I'm like, he's gone with his nephew, like they've all gone together, him and his cousin. I'm just like, I'm terrified. Yeah, yeah, cause really, you know what's real. When I was his age, yeah, you know I'm saying to you. So mm -hmm. it's like it made me realize it's like I want more him to be having more voices in his ear. I want him to that more positive voice. He doesn't have he to just would, be mine. If he's in the village and something's going wrong, something's got, village, I need, I need the village to be calling yeah. him up and saying, "Yo, stop, I know your dad, stop yeah, doing yeah, that. Like you can't do 100%. that. I need that. I'm not you, boy. That's not my. You, you get me? Like so, we have to like. We have, you know, it takes a village to raise a, raise go, a child. Go back. I know, and that's why you using the word village is very important because I can see where you're going with it. Yeah, it's yeah. a village. You treat it like a village. Yeah, no, come you on. on Definitely. You know when you used to fix up when you see your mum's brethren? You get me? Like, auntie, when you see auntie, like, yo, you're fix up, you're fix up, fix up. You put this, you know what I'm saying? You're hiding things. You're trying to, like. Cigarettes were burning out the middle of your eyes. <laughs> you just there chatting to her, like, yeah, I beg you just cut those so I can be his buddy, my thing. Bye. <laughs> yeah, I get it. No. So, yeah, we, yeah we've got to represent, though. That was big, up, you, big up you, man, though. Definitely. No, bitch, Come respect, on. Respect, love for coming through. I two, what, and you got no shows coming up, Vic? Um, yeah, so 11th of May, I'm doing Box Park, Shoreditch. Um, I've got one in the middle and at the end. I'll announce it just, you know, down the line. Mm -hmm. Got new music coming, um, so I'll say from next week. Dan's, so this gonna, week. Dan's gonna put your socials somewhere. Yeah, definitely. Let it, yeah, let them keep. Yeah, follow the yeah. socials. Or oh, Rob, Wobby. Yeah. Socials. Hey, what's your favorite tune that you've made to date? The one I got coming out next, you know. Is it? Yeah. Is that just a promotion? Is that for promotional reasons? Nah, nah. About the one you got coming out next. What, what about the ones that's out already? Um, where did the app on this yeah, one? Yeah, no, where did the app is tough. Uh, that uh, bent my bit, not bent my bitch. That's <laughs> my God. Why for that? Yo. Whoa. 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 Bridging's a fan. <laughs> Bridging's straight though, no bending. <laughs> but my Bridging rates the thing that you get. Me? Yeah, so, no, wait till yeah, the album does this song still. Like that one, yeah. Come on, man. Yeah, yeah. No, nah, wait till the album does a song still. Like, I like performing it. That's the one that. Energy. I think it's the lingo switching, you know. It's just like, they're just saying, what did he just say? It just yeah, sounds hard, yeah, even if you don't understand yeah, what I'm talking like, about. Come on. <laughs> come on, man. Yeah, but. Now I pick up right, yourself. Listen. Big. Come yeah, on. What? That was a very nice, interesting interview i'm happy with it vic come on man pick up yourself always 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 always, always. you know the yourself my you know next week you don't know the thing people we are bigger like share and subscribe all that later